Hello again, officers. Have you come to admire my mural? What for? But boring. You're not using my lovely brush to spread boredom. I ain't helping no pigs fool honest upstanding citizens. I'm not an antisocial element. What do you think I'm trying to paint here? A mural for a better tomorrow? Why do you really need it? Well, if it's for art. But what kind of art are we talking about? Sounds like you're just about to live out your self-pity, not make a statement. I can't have shit art on my conscience. Yeah, not gonna hold my breath, piggy. You look like you'd suck. Uh, everything really. You should tell people to fuck off more often. That's the spirit. Never forget, the whole world's a wooden house and you're a goddamn flamethrower. A lorry stuck in the traffic jet. Promising race pupil returns. Phone.
aboard the cargo container. Its draw has not lessened since you were last here. If anything, it seems to have grown slightly. I knew you'd be back to talk with old Leo here. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. It's like Lady Larice said when she opened a bathhouse in the basement of my apartment building. They can only get so far before they're aching to get back. And lots of folk really did keep coming back. No trouble at all, mister. No trouble at all. It's like that old saying goes, wisdom withers if not shared. And... This orange machine is dead still. It has a hand-cranked ice cream churner and an electric freezer. The ice around it, slowly melting. You slip your fingers under the frozen lid, but the ice is too cold for you to get a good grip. A pry bar would come in handy here. If you want to try again, then you need to have the pry bar in your hand, detective. Equip the pry bar by going... This orange machine is dead still. It has a hand-cranked ice cream churner and an electric freezer. The ice around it, slowly melting. The ice squeaks beneath the pry bar. You think you've got the bar jammed in there pretty well, but the lid simply won't budge. You see the pry bar's metal handle bending right before your very eyes. That's a good pry bar, but this ice cream maker is frozen shut. It takes an advanced tool to get it open, some kind of super pry bar. You have no idea where to get one. Sooner or later, you will stumble upon a tool mighty enough. Then we will know what's in this mysterious ice cream maker.
Oh, it's you again. Are you looking for a die? You feel nothing. If anything, it's uncomfortably warm in here. Excuse me, what are you doing? Oh no, not the zipper. No, I don't feel hot. We're in a derelict smokestack. If anything, then it's cold here. And why would you do that? And what technique is that? Officer, this isn't how mature adults deal with their feelings. Now you feel something. The cold damp of shame washing over you. The air pressure told you to take your pants off in my studio? This is not going very well, is it? Word-wise. Can you please employ this special technique somewhere else? I work here and my work requires concentration. Half-naked people don't help with that. Barbell waits patiently on the floor, like a dog for its master. Conjuring up an inhuman amount of strength, you raise the barbell up in the air. Your biceps tremble, but you're a savage. This is a children's game. A warm wave of accomplishment washes over your head as you drop the barbell to the floor. For a moment, it feels like you're strong enough to succeed at anything you ever set your mind to. Hey, but you're still in the ghost house. What if someone heard this? What if they know you're here?
Hello, hello. Let me know if I can help you with anything. Traffic? I'm sorry, officer, but I don't drive. I just don't like it very much. Movement on the road never really gelled well with the movement of my thoughts. Now that I think about it, I do remember hearing a thunderous noise the other night. Some kind of powerful electric vortex hitting the shop and then moving on. Yeah, it was pretty wild. I didn't really know what to make of it, but I know it meant something. A mirror hangs on the bathroom wall. It's barely covered in steam anymore. It's your face in the mirror, adorned with the expression. Still not happening. It won't come off that easy.
A cockatoo is a parrot with an erectile crest found on the Seminine Islands and in southern Fas a la Mer. Known for their intelligence and general precociousness, cockatoos are popular birds in aviculture. However, they often exhibit various behavioral issues. This book talks about the delicate nature of twos, as well as introducing some of the most popular species among the bird enthusiasts. The funeral cockatoo, the major majestic cockatoo, and the most common bang-bang cockatoo. It's colorfully illustrated. Where to even begin? All cockatoos are known for their needy natures, requiring attention for at least two full hours a day. They love to talk and have been described as lovable clowns who just don't know how to wrap up. Pet owners also report moodiness, loudness, and hostility as recurring issues. If left unsatisfied, cockatoos may scream non-stop, pluck their feathers, or become aggressive. It is not recommended to get a cockatoo if you're not able to cook them food every day and give them the full care that they need. These birds will never understand that you have a life of your own. You're right. Cockatoos are magnificent creatures. They love to perform, cuddle and show off, and will even scream for fun, often as loud as up to 135 decibels. Ouch, that must hurt. Not great for the neighbors. This is a yellow-tailed black cockatoo. Its specific name, Sitarchus fenarius, relates to its dark and somber plumage. This bird looks as if dressed for a funeral, 24-7. There is something indisputably ominous about it. Perhaps the most impressive of all the species, the endangered major majestic cockatoo, is often described as the most flamboyant bird in the jungle. Its pink-colored wings and flowing crest embellishing its proud and bumptious nature. In the words of poet-explorer Sir James Fournier, few birds more enliven the monotonous hues of the verdant forest than this big, bold, and beautiful species. It must be glorious to behold, dark pink and snow white. Despite its banging name, the bang-bang cockatoo is actually the shyest of the species, common in almost all Seminese forests, as well as zoos and homes all over the world. Its plumage is mainly gray and white. The Seminese name bang-bang is thought to be of onomatopoeic origins. Yes, but all those cockatoo species are so different. Which one are you? You're right. Your Setarchus Fenarius embodied. This ominous bird belongs on your heraldry. Advanced Race Theory. Everything is calm in the eye of the race storm. Your mind is lucid and bright. The mind-bending phylogenetics appear more distant and, to be fair, a little ridiculous. The great race mystery has cleared up. All that's left to do is verbalize your thoughts. Go and talk to Measurehead about your newly found insights. Tremble, the time is now. Taola. Time for the show. For Taola, the hallowed time of fear and disintegration. A countdown has begun. All will collapse on itself. The world will disappear into a single grain of blackness. All sound will be muted. All life will scream. Ulogu Theodos, Xino Zausin, Ipoli Osidien, Echondes Fronisin.
Monday morning, the moment you arrived in this reality, are the first crack in the sheer face of God. From you it will spread. Yes, you spoke the words of the Palindropos and the houses of Pericarnassus. Items, people, even words will tumble. All will lose its meaning in the coming years. That is why you marked yourself. It's totally also a coping mechanism. So you should be. The world island crumbles at your feet and in the far plain, Palindropos. Perhaps, just a thought. This has something to do with the hangover. The face of the woman fractures. There will be herd killing. We all become vapor. Promising race pupil returns. And look, babe. The fossilized rock and roll rebel challenges me, a figure of authority. Is trying to reinstate his individualism with swear words taken from rock songs from the last century. Individualism has really fucked him over, Jean. You could have used this opportunity to overcome your narrow, al rule ravaged identity. Instead of unlocking the race enigma, you attempted to add to it unsuccessfully. Take solace from the fact that these thoughts will never entirely leave your brain. They will be with you on the day you die. The only germ of heroism in your body. Now go. I have beauty and truth to discuss with my woman. Damn, Jean. How are you so romantic? Was there an out of this for you with success, or was the rhetoric game rigged? I can't tell. 